as we look at the A8, which is, let's say, our flagship, it's very majestic, very bold statement, and later on the A6, the A7 is embedded in between. The A7 for sure is characterized with very precise lines, a very low front end, but definitely the A7 is characterized by the rear end. And this boat tail finish, this almost negative shape of the rear end, is our theme. We have been defining the A7, and I think this is a very strong, remarkable detail in the car. In the interior design, we really tried to continue the slim and athletic language of the exterior also inside the car. And it has almost a yacht or boat feeling with the wraparound theme in front of the dashboard. The dashboard is extremely slim and it creates a certain feeling of lightness. We have aluminium body panels and therefore we wanted to create this feeling of lightness also in the interior. And I think this is really the marking point of the of the whole interior design. the slim and athletic language of the exterior also inside the car and it has almost a yacht or boat feeling with the wraparound theme in front of the dashboard. The dashboard is extreme negative shape of the rear end is our theme. We have been defining the A7 and I think this is a very strong remarkable detail in the car. In the interior design we really tried to continue. The A7 for sure is characterized with very precise lines, a very low front end, but definitely the A7 is characterized by the rear end. And this boat tail finish is almost really slim and it creates a certain feeling of lightness. We have aluminium body panels and therefore we wanted to create this feeling of lightness also in the interior. And I think this is really as we look at the A8, which is, let's say, our flagship, it's very majestic, very bold statement, and later on the A6, the A7 is embedded in between.